Magic penguins? Don't ask. Sadie pointed to the children inside. How does it work? They see images in the water? It's oil, Zia said. But yes. So few, Sadie said. Are these the only initiates in the whole city? In the whole world, Zia corrected. There were more before... She stopped herself. Before what? I asked. Nothing, Zia said darkly. Initiates do our scrying because young minds are most receptive. Magicians being in training no longer than the age of ten, with a few dangerous exceptions. You mean us, I said. She glanced at me apprehensively, and I knew she was still thinking about what the bird had said and called me a good king. It seems so unreal, like our family name in the blood of the Pharaoh scroll. How could I be related to some of the ancient kings? And even if I was, I certainly wasn't a king. I had no kingdom, and I didn't even have a single suitcase anymore. They'll be waiting for you, Zia said. Come along. We walked so far, my feet began to ache. Finally, we arrived at a crossroads. On the right was a massive set of bronze doors with fires blazing on either side. On the left, a twenty-foot-tall sphinx was carved into the wall. A doorway nestled between its paws, but it was bricked in and covered in cobwebs. That looks like the sphinx at Giza, I said. That's because we are directly under the real sphinx, Zia said. That tunnel leads straight up to it, or it used to before it was sealed. But I did some quick calculations in my head. The Sphinx is like 20 miles from the Cairo airport, roughly. No way we've walked that far. Zia actually smiled, and I couldn't help noticing how pretty her eyes were. Distance changes in magic places, Carter. Surely you've learned that by now. Sadie cleared her throat. So why is the tunnel closed then? The Sphinx was too popular with archaeologists, Zia said. They kept digging around. Finally, in the 1980s, they discovered the first part of the tunnel under the Sphinx. Dad told me about that, I said, but he said the tunnel was a dead end. It was when we got through, it was when we got through with it. We couldn't let the archaeologists know how much they're missing. Egypt's leading archaeologists recently speculated that the whole thing they've discovered was only 30% of the ancient ruins in Egypt. In truth, they only discovered one-tenth, and not even the interesting tenth. What about... King Tut's tomb, I protested. The boy king? Zia rolled her eyes. Boring. You should see some of the good tombs. I felt a little hurt. Dad had named me after Howard Carter, the guy who discovered King Tut's tomb, so I'd always felt a personal attachment to it. If it wasn't a good tomb, I wondered what was. Zia turned to face the bronze doors. This is the Hall of Ages. She placed her palm against the seal, which bore the symbol of the House of Life. The hieroglyphics began to glow, and the doors swung open. Zia turned to us, her expression deadly serious. You are about to meet Chief Lecter. Behave yourselves, unless you wish to be turned into insects.